Howdy, y'all. Joe Hills here, recording as I always do in Nashville, Tennessee, and I'm joined today by the wonderful British zombie Cleo. Uh, behind you. Yeah. Uh, now, hello, everybody. <laughs> as you can see, Cleo, I made some changes um, just to try and figure out what we could do to give this place a little bit more pop. Like, mm -hmm. for example, I've jumped off a cliff that I'm now unable to jump back up while running backwards. Uh, but I've, I've also added this second row of the quartz ring here. Yeah, I was quite impressed with that one, actually. I, I felt like that would make it feel more magical. Um, it, it's, 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 it's the thing that's holding it up, so yeah. Yeah, that works. Yeah, and then I played with changing the elevation of the, um, of the island. So instead of having the top of the island be completely flat... It would actually have a, a change in height, with the lowest point being where the water poured out, right? Right, okay. So if we come up there, you can actually see it. Um, I kind of wasn't sure. I wanted to do one island first, and then if you liked it, I would, you know, uh, either I or we would continue on to the other islands, because yep, I don't want to do six of them and have them all be terrible and then <laughs> have to take it down. Um, so when... Okay. Ooh! Woo, pretty! Mm hmm And, and so, yeah. as you can see, um, unfortunately the grass hasn't spread over to this side yet. I might have to... Uh, oh, no, it'll get uh, there eventually. Yeah, it um, should do. But I... I oh, when, when did you do it? Say again? When oh, did you do it? About mm, two hours ago, maybe. Oh, I can see I've got a grass block on me, so... Oh, okay, great. So, um, these chunks just haven't been loaded because I haven't been over here. And I'm playing with how the uh, upper ring should, like, ring the uh, mm. island... It's, I'm not sure I like it. I was kind of thinking about just lowering the entire upper ring below the lip of the dirt um, by one block so it would be closer right. to the lower ring and not be as uh, crazy. Like, I, I, yeah. It made sense to have railings up here, but really, we fall off anyway. <laughs> and I, I guess what I'm saying is I'm not sure we're better off because of the railings, and I don't know. No. I, I, I'm, I'm not sure. Um... See, having it like this doesn't feel as 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 mystical to me somehow. Having it really close to the dirt blocks. Yeah, well, I, I can move the. I was thinking about moving the whole ring outward one. Yeah, that might well. probably that might probably be. Um, and so it'll feel more suspended. Yeah, I think I think that might work actually better. Come to think about it. Because um, like, I mean, we're we're falling off anyway. It's not these aren't <laughs> saving our lives. So I, no. yeah, I'll just come through here and start moving these all out one block. I've been using nether brick for my scaffolding because it's easy to break. So if you want some nether brick for scaffolding. Oh, that would be a good idea. Oh. I need to go to the nether brick. Nether brick, the nether. <sighs> Words are not my strong point today. It's okay. What is your strong point today? Uh, this is, this is Cleo's opportunity. Rugs is my, is my, Copious my amounts of logs? Rugs. Rugs? Today. Yep. Carpets. You have many carpets today. Yes, that's that's exactly what I said, Joe. It's hard to tell sometimes. <laughs> I'm okay. gonna go. I'm gonna start doing it from this one. Um, we want we want the highest point, so I'm gonna faff with the with the water level on this one. So. Oh, oh uh, yeah. I was gonna say this. Uh, are you on the second island now? I am. Yeah. Well, I wanted to talk to you about the second island as well, okay. and now is as good a time as any to do that. I was actually thinking, you see how the second island, we kind of have the water come straight over here? Mm-hmm. I was thinking that we would actually redirect the flow in more of a crescent. Um, so you want sort of like Oxbow Lake title? Oxbury Lake. That sounds Oxbow very... Oxbow Lake. Sounds very British. Um, but uh, I was going to say, like, kind of have it go around this way. Whoops. And that's not how we do that optimally. <laughs> um... So, but, so you want you want it serpentine sort of thing? Yeah, yeah. I was thinking having it ring the island and that could uh, work rather than just coming straight through to here. Yeah, that could work. I can get on with that, and then I can. And then we would build kind of a hill it. or whatever. Yeah. Here. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll get on with that, and I'll, and and you do a ring thing, and then and then we'll go up and have a look at the one up t above, and then we can talk about the fourth one that I've been thinking about. Okay, cool. And, then, and there's and also then, I, I tried making a tiny one, that tree one. I th this this I was really impressed with. You were impressed with that? I was worried I, I you was, were gonna hate it. No, I was I like, oh, that's the worst awesome. one. No, I thought it was awesome, uh, mostly because of the way the um, the ring is on it. I thought that was really good. Oh, so thank you. I was quite impressed with that one. So yeah, yay! You didn't suck. It was good. Yay! 
I'm like a non-faulty vacuum. Oh wait, no, I'm a faulty vacuum. <laughs> Either uh, way. Either way. Suck. Hooray. Okay. Right. So. This is where the danger comes in. So we bring this one up. Mm -hmm. So we took baby Corinne to the swimming pool for the first time today. Oh, um, yeah. How did that go? <laughs> uh, she was pretty dubious, as she is of most things. Essentially... She's like the most dubious baby ever. That's like her default face. Like if you're it's like a default setting, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You take her and you show her something incredible, and she's just like, eh, I don't know. Like, you Bless. know, we, we got all these, to you know, there's all these toys like that light up and stuff like that, and she's just like, well, I mean, your cell phone does that, you know. Yeah. Uh, show but, me something that I can be impressed with. Yeah, like like the one of the toys that she's really impressed with is this thing that spins. And, like, she's never been around anything that spins because, like, having a cell phone that spins really fast would not necessarily be helpful, you know? No, no, I can imagine not. <laughs> um, and, and so she's just like, oh, okay, this this I like. This is new. Um, but, yeah, so we took her to the swimming pool, and uh, Marion was carrying her and uh, wearing, like, she's got this, like, four-foot diameter big floppy hat that she wears when it's super <laughs> sunny out, so the baby... What? <laughs> Sorry, I've just got this image now of you and uh, you and Marion... In, 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 you know, taking babies at the swimming pool. It just makes me giggle. I don't know oh, why it just you. does. Well, we do try to be adorable. So Marion's yeah, you, you got succeed. her four-foot uh, four diameter hat, um, which I, for you guys, you guys use the metric system. It's like I know, yeah, but I know 1. What is. meters. Okay. It's a really big hat. And uh, so she's keeping the sun off the baby's eyes or whatever and just holding the baby such that uh, Corinne's toes are in the water but nothing else because, you know, um, she's a yeah. baby and we don't want to get her wet and, you know, have to deal with hypothermia and things. And, you know, there's also sanitary issues that we have to be considerate of the other people in the pool and stuff. Of course, of um, course. But, yeah, so, so she's just kind of like, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Bless. And uh, so finally it's my turn to hold the baby. And so I was smart enough to try something different, and I sit down on the steps with the baby and uh, mm -hmm. let the baby uh, stand up, like, on my legs, um, which are submerged in the water. And she really likes standing on people's legs and, like, uh, just trying to stand in general. She's not really good at it. You have to, like, hold her by her torso. Oh, she'll, she'll get there. She'll get there. Oh, yeah, eventually. But right now she's just terrible at it. Just abysmal at it. And... <sighs> So, but Babies as, thinking they can stand. How dare they? But as, as soon as I put her standing up in the water, she's like, oh, okay, this is what we do. We stand in the pool. So you guys have been standing in the pool, and you've been having all this fun, and I've just been being held, and it was lame. But now that I'm standing, this is the best thing ever. <laughs> and she's just like, like, completely no real difference. Like, she still just, like, has her feet in the pool. You know, barely her ankles are wet. But yeah. now she's ecstatic uh, because she's standing while she does it. And so that was that was fun. Um, I actually got video of when we first put her in the pool. I don't know if I'm going to post it, though, because it's just it's literally just her with her dubious face. And <laughs> <laughs> which is it's, it's kind of one of those things where it's like I'm, I might need to make a, uh, a montage of us showing baby new things and just baby with the dubious face. Just like, yeah, you, you yeah. can make that into a meme very quickly, I think. <laughs> yeah. Dubious baby hills. Yeah. Yeah. And um so, yeah, that was that was our big adventure for the day. Sounds so cute. It, it was. Fun. I mean, I'm 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 not a baby person, but but I could probably be a hills baby person. Oh, well, well thank you. That that's a very kind thing to say. <laughs> Mostly because I like babies who 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 have very serious faces because it makes me giggle. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she she is very emotive uh, about things like um. She woke up before the rest of us again because that's what she always does as a baby. <laughs> she takes this uh, ob this obligation very seriously. Oh, uh, naturally, you would, and, though, uh, wouldn't you? Oh, yeah, you just have to. Uh, you don't want to be the baby that just plays around. Um, nobody would respect you. Uh, <laughs> so she, she wakes up before the rest of us, and she's just lying in her crib, and she's just... Uh, babble into herself but like i realized that she's switching voices like she she's like babbling like oh but 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 oh but
And, and it's just like, I was so, I was like, Marion, Marion, Marion. The baby's doing different voices. Marion's just like, I'm tired. Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm tired. Leave me alone. You deal with it. And I'm like, no, it's not a problem. It's adorable. It's adorable. Yeah. <laughs> like, like she's having pretend conversations, which is like yeah. the cutest thing ever. And... <laughs> Um, yeah, so so I can stop just bragging about the baby. Oh, no, 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 but... brag about the baby all you like. People want to hear it. I yeah. mean, everybody wants to hear it. Oh, well, I mean, I'm I don't, bad. I don't, I don't, I, I think that's probably your, your, your strongest selling point at the moment is the fact that adorable baby. Well, you know, I try. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, so this ring been... is starting to come in. Oh, sorry, what were you saying? No, 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 no. go for it, go for it. I was, I was just saying the ring is starting to come in uh, around here. Boom. Yeah, I'm 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 extending this island so we can get the hilly bit part in. Wonderful. So, so it looks like um, uh, oh dang it, I, I keep I'm like, not Mumbo, <laughs> not Top Mass, the guy who just invited Mumbo over, who's not Top Mass. He's got a farm, but he's not Top Farm. Do- His name is in the bottom of the screen. His name is in the bottom of the screen because he's he's actively he's right typing. There. And I'm just like, this is this is being a parent, guys. You just don't know anything. Your brain is just, just sleep deprived. Just too tired to cope. Yeah, I was gonna say, Monkey Farms house is nearly complete apparently because he just invited Mumbo over to look at it. Oh, you can see them working on it over there. This is really cool. I like, I like that we can make videos on the server and have people like working within visual range of each oh, other. I see them. I see them. Isn't that cool? I'm gonna wave at them. Hi. I need to I need to wave verbally at them, or or textually. We're at the same level as well. Yeah, you can tap slash me and it'll it'll send it as an action. It's so cute. Ay! Yeah, don't fall. No. That is undesirable behavior. Which I'm amazed is not the name of a film. Undesirable behavior should be the name of a film. Wait, did did they fire an arrow at you? Yes. Oh, I wish I'd brought snowballs Stop now. It. <laughs> they probably think you're me. Because they're saying, hey, Joe, while they do it. I don't have a bow. This is unfair. It's like cheating. You know, anything that's lack cheating but isn't cheating, I would say is explicitly fair. Whose side are you on, Joe? Whose side are you on? You know, I don't like to think of things in terms of size. I, I like to think of them in terms of like... Wrong answer! You're on my side, Joe. Deal with it. Okay, I'm on Cleo's side. And I'm expertly handling it. <laughs> I need to... Right. So who is it? It's... It's... Ah. Now it's I monkey need... Farm now I and Mumbo it. Jumbo. Yeah, good job. Monkey Farm and Mumbo. Okay, it's right there. Then they're on the list. Yes. I have a total list. I really do, actually, but... Oh, a list of everybody on the server? Oh, no, you no, mean no, you no, 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 a list of people that are going to be Cleoed. Oh, uh, what is Cleoed? I know spooned means, like, watermelon. Oh, I haven't decided what it is, but it might involve zombies. Oh, interesting. It seems like it, seems like it should involve zombies, regardless. I kind of see that, but, like... Zombies are hard to wrangle, and they despawn. You'd have to name tag them all, and that's super... I've got plenty of name tags. How do you have plenty of name tags? They're, like, impossible I've, I've, to get. I go spelunking. Oh. It's, it's my thing. Really, I like I need spelunking. to do that. Yeah. Now, do you record, when, like, videos when you spelunk, usually? Not really, no. I, I'm, I'm more of a, more of a, you know, go and do it. Because I don't really... Um, I don't really do it when I'm in the mood for talking, so so mm-hmm. I tend to just just go and do my thing, and then yeah. I've got to say, investing in feather fallen boots before starting this project was absolutely genius. I'm back on the ground again. Are you <laughs> fallen again? <laughs> I've fallen like three or four times, but it doesn't matter because I have feather fallen boots. You fall. You fall more than I do, and that's probably saying something. I nearly fell again. But that's why I route around the damage by having the proper boots. Ta-da. Boots. Ta-da! Okay, so I'm short on quartz. Um, You said you had to go to the nether for something anyway? I've I've not... I I just need to go to the nether because I've not actually done um, quartz farming 
yet. Well, you so. don't farm it, you uh, man it. Yeah, I, I know, I know. I've not done that yet. Because I'm... But yeah, because the ring is wider now, it took uh, more... Um... Yeah, yeah. You know what? It... I, I've tried it with... I think I'm going to have the, the floating ones, like on the diagonals right now, I, I turned them all into L's instead of mm -hmm. just straight dashes of quartz, if that makes sense. But I think I'm going to turn it into dashes of quartz. I think it needs to be dashes, actually, because because this... It looks too thick otherwise. Yeah, in those parts. yeah. Hey, Biff is back. And there's going to be trouble. Hey, uh. <laughs> um, yeah, Biff I... was on Halls recently. Hall, oh. oh. Which apparently is, uh, Halls, maybe. I don't know. How do you, how do you say it? It's, it means, like, holidays. Halls. Halls. Yeah, he, he was on Halls recently. Apparently he went to the sea. Oh, there's a lot of it about being, like, you know, tiny island. Yeah, I haven't figured that. Although I'm about as far from these seas as you can get. Ooh, I just fell again. <laughs> I don't think there's much point in my being AFK mob farming. Probably not. Well, uh, yeah, well, I mean, he's welcome to hang out. He can, he can chill, but, you know. Yep. Oh, man. I cannot wait until, um, like, as much as I, I, I know the server gets kind of boring once you have enough of every resource, I just really am looking forward to the point where it's like, oh, I need 25 stacks of dirt. Let me go get them from my chest. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I've got, I've got five stacks, and I wanted to get started on the main part of the next island, because I think the next island's got to be way bigger. Mm -hmm. It's got to be, like, the, 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 the top island, mm -hmm. um... But I just don't know how I'm going to do it. And and what you you guys refer to that as what Northern Ireland? Yes, yes. That that is that is, is how that, is that the first... preferred nomenclature? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Okay. Let's work with that. Okay, that one's mm, that's a bit far out. I think I need to put one there, and then take this one out. Sorry. Oh, sugar. Okay, yeah, I just had a uh, a button get stuck and I just fell off again. <laughs> Third time? Third time now? Yeah, I think... I I'm think, not I telling think... you every time I fall. I've fallen off this thing like 20 times. Less. It's You're a... worse than me. And that's, like, saying a lot. Well, uh, dang it, I just overshot my jump. <laughs> if people watching Monkey Farm's video are going to watch this video. And they're going to go... How many times did you fall off, Joe? It was a lot. Yeah, they're, they're going to be like, why does that guy keep jumping off the thing in the background <laughs> of Monkey Farm's video? <laughs> oh, okay. one thing that I want to do is, uh, is uh, Cilantro was talking about how nobody better steal it. Like, go, go get sand from the, right, from the correct desert. Don't just steal it from mine, because I'm going to keep an eye out for people stealing my sand. I want to oh. get an invisibility potion. And, and just, <laughs> just go, go over there only when he's filming. And just yes. steal sand at, like, the edge of the view distance? Yes. If you need help with that, I will totally help you with that, because that will be really funny. I know, right? Because Cilantro, he's a great guy, but, you know, we, we gotta mess with him, too. <laughs> you gotta mess with everybody. I mean, yeah. it's like the law. You oh, can't oh, just oh. not mess with him because he's so awesome. No. That's not why he's here. That's not why any of us are here. Yeah, we're not here gotta for special men. treatment. No, we're here to torment everybody because we can. Okay, so now I'm taking the water pillar down to pick up some of the quartz that I might have dropped. I've definitely right. lost quartz in this process. If you, if you can find, yeah, if you can find any of the dirt that has just fallen out of this island, that would be appreciated. You know, okay. whilst you're down there on one of your many turns. Yes, well, I, I found some dirt whilst I was down there just now. Yeah. It is just scattered and strewn about. I know, it was terrible abandon, of me. But I have... I have found it, and I'm going to devour me some steak real quick. Head back up. Mmm, steak. Oh, oh, Cleo. 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 Yes, so, yes. So I, I want to say this on video. Because, oh, right, okay. Because my fans have already had gotten to enjoy this. Um, but I, I don't know, you might right. have to cut this out of your video if you actually wanted to do it and have it be effective. Uh-huh. 
but uh, you uh, you and I should have an, a, a discussion about the benefits of you switching to all black and white for your video uploads because of how much faster it would go on account of only needing the uh, eight bits of grayscale <laughs> instead of. Um, so I I, I, posed, I I mentioned in my latest video that's like live today that I, I was thinking about switching to black and white just as a joke. And yeah. I got like eight hundred comments that are like. Dude, don't switch to black and white. Oh my god, black and white would be terrible. Don't do it, man. And then there's a few people who are just like, I, you know, maybe, you know, maybe we should trust him. Like, he makes things that we don't make. Maybe he knows. <laughs> so, so if you want, we can have a serious conversation about the benefits of switching to black and white. Now, he, here's the best part, is... Um, so I was telling Joe Nagy about this, and he's doing the same thing. He's about to uh, introduce this concept in his next video. And uh, he, his, um, what he's going to do, though, is then the video after that, and I'm doing this now, too, the video after that, he's actually going to start the first, like, 35 seconds in black and white. <gasps> totally needs to happen. And do the thumbnail in black and white. Isn't that brilliant? That is genius. I wish I had thought about that part. And so, um, yeah, I'm, I'm totally, yeah, th this is... Yeah, like totally going to happen. Totally going to happen. Okay. Yeah, I, I need to do that. I might... I might Hmm. So you're gonna have to edit out this part that this conversation we just had. I but am, I'm gonna I leave am. it on my channel, so so uh, so your people are aware because they've already they've already enjoyed this uh, personally <laughs> by the time that this goes live. Oh dear! And now they have an explanation for it, uh, which oh, yeah, actually works because yeah. uh, I wasn't gonna explain it in that video. Okay, does this river look okay? Yeah, I like this a lot. Yeah, and then we could put like flowers and uh, stuff like that along. Yeah. I um, want to go get red flowers because we've only got yellow flowers up here. Oh yeah, oh. that'd be cool. I'm gonna and go get red. Flowers. I've awesome. got mushrooms, but they won't go up here, will they? Uh, mushrooms require a certain darkness level. Yeah, when they pop so out. it's not really gonna work up up this high, I don't think. No, I'm gonna go ahead and put a glowstone in right here because it's kind of dark. Mm -hmm. If that's okay. Yeah, no, 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 absolutely. Whatever you feel is is correct probably is. And I'm going down to, to pick flowers. I'm actually going down to pick flowers. Wonderful. Something so I don't really do, but you know, sod it, we'll do you, it. You don't pick flowers in real life. You, no. You, only in video no. games. Okay, in fairness, you probably don't shoot skeletons in real life. Um, so there's there's that. Um, it has been known, but you know, it's not a common thing. Oh man, yeah. Okay, oh, so I should buy, I should go to the party store. Um, when we go to play on con, uh, there's going to be uh, actual archery there because it's at a summer camp. Mm -hmm. And so I should buy like a Halloween plastic skeleton. Do you guys have Halloween or do you call it something different? No, we you have Halloween. You might call it Samhain or something? No, 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 no. Halloween is pretty typical. Okay. Um, buy like a plastic Halloween skeleton from yeah. a party store at discount and then go uh, <laughs> hang it up. Sorry, on I'm, I'm, I'm picking flowers by the duck now. Oh, yeah. It's so beautiful. It's such a pretty duck. Unfortunately, uh, it looks like <laughs> King reads the chat when he's away. He, he commented. He's like, you guys know that I'm reading about it. And I'm like, no. Well, he can't know how awesome it is until he's there. That's true. Yeah, it, it will be a surprise that this is not terrible. Because we made it. It's Of course it's not terrible. Exactly. That's that's why we made it. Yeah. Or it why? had to be awesome, otherwise we wouldn't do it. Mm -hmm. That's like the law. Yeah, okay. speaking of which, have you considered switching your videos over to black and white? Like, it I might haven't. sound counterintuitive, but here's the thing, right? Um, you know, your internet's not the best, right? No, it's not. So, think about how much better you could do if each of your videos uploaded in a tenth the time. Wow. I hadn't thought about that. I could do so many more videos. And, like, for example, if you go to your inventory, right, and you mouse over something, like uh, white wool, right? It just yeah. says wool. Well, I guess white wool doesn't say white wool. It just says wool. But if yeah. you mouse over, like, yellow wool, it'll say yellow wool. So people can still know what color your stuff is yeah, even without just, you they... having the wow. chromatic incorporation of all that extra bits and bytes and megas and gigas. I had not thought of that. That is probably one of the best ideas I think you've ever had, Joe. Thank you. I've been trying to find ways to increase my output video-wise, and it is just an incredible time saver. Also, in the editing process, like, because um, the throughput of the, uh, like, I, I don't know, do you use Premiere or Movie Maker or something? 
Uh, I, I tend to use uh, Premiere. Okay, well, you, you know how, like, you can only write the movie to disc so fast because yeah. the disc Yeah, oh, has... it takes forever. It exactly. Takes forever. Well, what if it didn't take forever? Wouldn't you be able to make more videos? I would. See? Now, you see, this is this is this is the kind of genius I've come to expect from you. Well, so... and, and this is one of the benefits um, of playing on the Hermitcraft server because you have access to all of these brilliant people who have all these different mm. ideas and different techniques. And you know, yes, we're a group that we we play together, but we also work together. And um, I'm excited about you know you being a part of that and being able to benefit from our collective knowledge. Yeah, I'm 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 quite impressed with all the things you've all taught me so far. I mean, this this might just blow it out of the water though. To be fair, because I think I think to be honest, that is not something I would have thought of on my own. I'd have to throw it up to open to my viewers. I'm sure they'd agree though, wouldn't you? Black and white is just classy. Oh yeah, they would be like, I love me some Ricky Ricardo. Or um, wait, do you guys have I Love Lucy in England? Um, not really, but well, I, um, I, I know. I what love me about. some series one Doctor Who. Oh uh, yeah, oh, that, that yeah, was in black that, and white on the BBC. Um, wasn't the coronation in black and white? That that's super classy. Uh, the, yeah, that yeah. It's it's just it's just a way of showing how how much you know you respect people as well to actually think I think you can handle this because people who do it in color just think I don't think you can handle black and white. Well, I just need to I just need to have it all be about uh, flashiness and gimmicks and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like that NBC Peacock always showing off, you know. You don't need yeah. to be that guy. You can be. No, I, 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 I don't. I, I, can, I can. do. I can be monochromatic, and they would. They would. They would be happy with that. I think. Oh yeah, dude. Seriously, just ask your viewers. They will just jump all over this. This oh, is yeah. one of the best things because everybody loves more throughput, and everybody loves being treated like an adult. You know. You didn't oh, see anybody on the Andy Griffith show being treated like a child, except for you know the children. But I'm sure your viewers are not children; they're sheriffs. My, my, Do you guys have no, the Andy Griffith show? Sorry, I keep no. asking stuff like that. I honestly have no idea what you guys don't have. <laughs> no, but I, I'm just going to assume that it, that it that it's classy because you mentioned it. Oh, it, it is. It is. Um, have you seen Arrested Development at all? I haven't, but people are going to yell at me for that. Oh, okay. Well, I, I was going to say the guy um, who the narrator from Arrested Development got his start in show business on the Andy Griffith show. Mm. Um, okay, but anyway, I'm just going to smile and nod. <laughs> I, I'm thinking we should have some leaves tumbling down. Well, yeah, it's one of the well. Um, Okay, we can talk about the leaves. I, I was going to talk no, about go, go I was going to talk just, about the Eddie Griffith show because it's such yeah, a, a, talk about, talk it, about it's such a, a classic piece of Americana, mm -hmm. like. But I guess I kind of understand why that, because it's it's like about a small town in the south, and like the sheriff and his son, and and everybody's kind of goofy, and I, I guess you guys probably had some sort of equivalent show of like, oh look at these people, they live in Devonshire, they're so unrefined, <laughs> but they have country sensibilities. Oh. Uh, actually, yes, I th I think I think I think when I was a kid, it was it was things like. Like like really old seventy shows and like like on the buses and stuff like that. So yeah, the, the, this was from the fifties. This was like one of the first like American TV yeah. shows. It yeah, was we, we had something like. like that. Yeah, and it was all about like Londoners and stuff like that. So yeah, it was it was similar. That's cool. Um, yeah, I, I've noticed that there does seem to be a British modern subgenre of like shows about the countryside. Um, like uh, Doc Martin, I particularly enjoyed. I don't know if you watched that. Not sure, I know it. It honest. takes place in Cornwall. It, it's about a city doctor who uh, moves to Cornwall, and everybody there is is just like trying to be his friend all the time, and he just wants to be left alone and do his work. And if this was an American show. Then mm -hmm. you would find out that this guy was, he really wanted to make friends, but something happened to him that was tragic and he just, he couldn't. And, and it's up to these people to like make his life better by sh teaching him friendship. But this is not, this is not an American show. <laughs> the guy just for six seasons, all he wants to do is like make Leave people better and work on clocks. Yeah, he like, he like has a hobby of like working on clocks. Yeah. He, there, there is, there's no moment where he's just like, oh, I want to be a part of this community. It's just like no. no, this community's terrible. I hate Cornwall. This is this is terrible. I'm not. I'm not surprised. I've been to Cornwall. It wouldn't surprise me, to be oh, honest. Nice. <laughs> no, I'm being sarcastic. Um, no. Uh, yeah. We as a, as a country, I think we're very like that. It's just like just leave me alone. I don't care. Just mm. I just want to be left alone. Are we going one up with the, the blocks? 
What do you mean? I, I was just... been going one out. Was I also supposed to go one up? Or what are you? Hang on, let me have a look over the side. I don't, I don't know what we're doing to be honest. Are you, are you talking to me about the outer no, port? Yeah, I know, I know what I'm doing now. Thank you. I just had to look. Yeah, like that. Yeah, it's it's one out, and and it's at the same height that they were before, I think. Or no, it's actually it's actually um. It's it's like it, it's like if you laid it atop the grass here. And then put a block mm -hmm. between it. It's directly parallel. Oh, okay. Does that make sense? the The old ones were a different height, but I'm the the railing ones were a different height, but I moved them on this so that stuff okay, wouldn't so spoil up there. Okay, so it's out and down, really. Yeah. yeah well, okay. it's out and on top of the dirt, kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. Got it. So. Looks like somebody just blew up the enchanting station. What? <laughs> Where? Well, they're they're talking about um. How, how it's not safe over at uh, the Enchanting Station. <laughs> There's so many places where mobs are spawning. You know, um, whose house is that next door to mine? I can't remember. Um, Ooh, which one? Uh, that might be Juicetra's. I think sure. that's the, 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 the semicircle one opposite my house. That one just mm -hmm. has everything spawn on it at night. It's just ridiculous. Yeah, people don't light their roofs up, and then it does not help anyone. It is bad. No. <laughs> it's bad news. Bad news, bears. Oh, indeed. Man, okay, I think I just heard the deadbolt be thrown, which okay. means that my wife and baby have returned and are likely laden with such groceries as might require the assistance of a That's young cool. gentleman such as myself to carry. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and place these last three quartz blocks here, which completes the entire outer ring. Sure thing. Oh, I did it wrong. <laughs> now, I, now I've got to jump off if I want to finish this. Oh, this is terrible. Well, it's not like you're not used to jumping off. Yeah, I know, but I also want to go get the groceries and help my wife and the baby. Um, so, anyway, let me just run up there and add that <laughs> one final block. I was about to say goodbye, you know, um... But yeah, I hope your viewers uh, are really excited about the black and white thing. I think that that will. I think will... they will. I think I think I think they'll they'll be they'll they'll be appreciative of it. They, they'll like if you think about how many people got excited about the coronation. Just think about how yeah. many more people will get excited about this with the advent of the internet age. You know. Oh yeah. Oh you yeah. You couldn't just watch the coronation from anywhere in the world. You had to be at a television. But now, I mean, with YouTube and the internet, I mean, you can watch uh, Cleo's Cleo Nation from anywhere. Yeah, that Sounds works. Sounds awesome. So, anyway, Cleo, I'm going to say goodbye. Until next time, y'all, this is Joe Hills from Nashville, Tennessee. Joined by Zombie Cleo. Any final words, Cleo? Uh, keep on adventuring. Those were also my final words. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so I was... I, what, what is it you say? You, you say, like, cheers or bye-bye. I say bye-bye, yes. Bye-bye, yes. <laughs> yes, yes, bye-bye. Bye bye, bye bye. I gotta go see the baby. Bye bye, so I can tend to That's the baby fun. and get the groceries. Bye bye, bye. Yes, yes, yes.